Welcome back everybody to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan, and I just want to say that we are officially super close to Scream 6, 19 days to go. But uh, we're not talking about Scream tonight. <laughs> we'll talk about Scream in a future video. But first, I also just want to say thank you guys so much for all the, um, the comments and all the encouragement you guys have been giving me these past few days. It's It's been really awesome and... I appreciate you guys. It it makes me feel makes me feel good, you know, that I have actually people who are supporting the channel and and love the videos and do all that. And like I said before, look, I don't make these videos for super attention, right? I make them because I just enjoy doing YouTube videos. I like talking about games and scream and movies and whatever, right? Whatever's on my mind. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to say thank you guys so much uh, for all the support for all the likes we've gained so many subscribers you know we're almost to 500 like that is a huge milestone for such a small channel that we are and uh, we couldn't be more blessed and and happy to have you all you guys here participating in all things nerd and uh yeah it's just a it's a cool thing so all right enough with being sappy i wanted to talk about apparently there was some news that um, Activision has signed a 10 year deal with a Nintendo that they're going to be bringing Call of Duty to Nintendo and to the Nintendo Switch. That is some interesting news, right? Because we've seen other AAA games that have already been on the Nintendo Switch. And if you tried to play a AAA game on the Nintendo Switch, I've heard that, um, you know, playing it streaming it via the cloud it's not the greatest thing in the world kind of like resident evil village for instance so i'm curious to see if nintendo is going to be coming out with a more powerful switch coming up in the future i think that they're gonna try to compete probably with the steam deck you know if anybody's going to compete with the steam deck it's probably going to be nintendo but then it seemed to you know I, I i actually have a i have a steam deck myself from valve and the thing is really cool. Like if you guys haven't picked up a Steam Deck, I definitely recommend it. I know they're not cheap. Um, they're kind of expensive, but I think the cheapest one is about $400. So it's not too bad, you know, uh, but they're definitely worth the, worth the investment. Man, if I could talk tonight, they're definitely worth the investment. Um, if you're looking to get into PC handheld gaming, it's really cool. But uh, yeah, I'm excited to see how this deal is going to turn out. I think it's really going to shape the way Call of Duty's played. You know, we've already seen Call of Duty played on mobile. And it's it's not really a surprise to me that they're making this deal. I think that, um, well, I should say that it's not really surprising because, you know, we've seen it on mobile. We've seen it on the Wii, uh, you know, growing up. I, you know, people had Call of Duty Black Ops for the Wii, I remember. Uh, you seen it on the GameCube, or I think there was Call of Duty on the GameCube, right? Was there Call of Duty on the GameCube? Maybe someone can correct me on that. <laughs> uh, but we've seen it on the Xbox, the PlayStation, the PC. I mean, Call of Duty has been known, and it is everywhere, right? You can find Call of Duty everywhere. Even on your phone now, people play Call of Duty Mobile. Like, Call of Duty is a known genre, and I like Call of Duty. I, I really do. I grew up playing Call of Duty myself. I thought the Call of Duty games were a lot of fun. My all-time favorite Call of Duty was uh, Call of Duty Black Ops. I love the original Black Ops. I had so much fun playing that growing up. Loved playing all the zombies and stuff like that with friends and all that. Um, I haven't touched the Call of Duty since... It's been a minute. It's been a hot minute. I haven't picked up or purchased the Call of Duty. I kind of just fell out of Call of Duty. I don't hate it. Like Everybody wants to jump on the bandwagon of let's hate Call of Duty because it's Call of Duty, right? Change something different. It's stupid. I hate when people say that. I think it's dumb. You know, they're always going to make Call of Duty Call of Duty, right? That's what you should expect. I mean, I don't want them to go full battlefield mode on Call of Duty. That's why I don't buy a Call of Duty because uh, I don't buy a Call of Duty expecting it to be battlefield or expecting it to be Dark Souls, right? I expect it to be Call of Duty. So I think this is a good move for Activision teaming up with Nintendo. I have a feeling that they're going to try to, like I said earlier, make a more powerful switch. I've got my hands on a Switch before, and I like them. I prefer the Steam Deck just because I'm more of a PC gamer, but Switches are cool. You know, if you enjoy the Nintendo games and you like Zelda and Mario and all that, you know, that's that's the route to go. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to talk about this real quick. 
what do you guys think about Call of Duty coming to the Nintendo Switch? Do you think it's a good deal? Do you think that this is a smart move on Activision's part and Nintendo's? Um, you know, everything at the end of the day is always about money, right? So this isn't a big surprise for both um, companies here. Uh, but yeah, it's going to be interesting to see. Are we going to see Mario and Zelda with guns? <laughs> Probably not, right? But that would be fun, though. But anyways, guys. Yeah, so yeah, let me know what you know. Um, let me know what you know. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. What's your opinion on Call of Duty coming to Nintendo? Do you think that it's going to be awesome? Do you think it's going to be a waste of money? Are you going to purchase if you have a Switch? Are you going to purchase Call of Duty and play it? I mean, let me know what you think. Um, but anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please like the video. If you haven't yet, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.